Guys, this is really cool because I have been wanting to eat at this place called Shaw's Wharf Restaurant from watching Andy Goodspeed's videos. And we're gonna eat there. This is awesome. So it's a real treat on our third day in Maine. We've got Andy and <clears throat> Simone, well, Andy's mom and dad. Of course, Aunt Simone's with us too. And here's the Granite Hall store. <clears throat> and we're all walking up here to check out this, this view of the coast. It'll be really nice beautiful day i mean so far we've had great weather <clears throat> what's the name of this little harbor it's round pond round pond okay. it was really neat to see this part of Maine. This is the working part where the lobster men go out in their lobster boats. And it was pretty cool to see. And it was a beautiful setting. The water was so blue. The boats sitting out the harbor was so awesome. Something you don't see in Appalachia, that's for sure. I could have stood there all day taking in the sights and the sounds and the beauty of this harbor. But we headed on back and we're going to check out this Granite Hall store. Granite Hall store has been around since 1873. And so the local community has relied on this store for a long time and you can get just about anything you want in here as you can see toys you can get candy there's ice cream there's all kind of books and there's jams and jellies and it is just a really cool place i enjoyed this style if i wrote you song if I got every word perfectly weighted on a thin piece of paper would it make any difference would it change for the better if I wrote you a poem if I posted a letter so after checking out the Granite Hall store, we headed over to Pemaquid Beach area, Fort William Henry, and the Pemaquid Lighthouse. Is it maybe because I never knew quite where I was and suddenly you told me maybe
is what am I supposed to do? If you are not the one, not the one for me, then tell me now what I could do. If I told you that I don't know where I'm going, don't know what to say. We walked around Fort William Henry and then we also went into the museum and checked out all the artifacts and enjoyed this beautiful view. And then we decided we got to go eat lobster. So we headed over to Shaw's Wharf. We didn't ride that boat though. <laughs> Let's go check it out. When you order them, that's where they gotta get them from. It is what they get them from, yeah. <clears throat> Prices, right? Right. I don't see any big ones in here today. Doesn't seem to be any two or three pounders. They seem to all be that one in the corner is pretty big. So that one over there is a good size. Small, you want the smaller ones anyway, they taste better. It's all hurt. It's all been told. The smaller ones, the better ones, the larger ones. Talk about fresh lobster. Right off the boat, into the tank, cleaned, steamed, and right to your table. It was truly a lobster feast and 
enjoyed the company, Tom and Sharon and Andy and Simone. It was so much fun, and we watched the lobstermen, fishermen, bring in the lobsters. Fisherman's Wharf, their Shaw's Wharf, was really cool. And so we decided then we're going to head over to the Pemaquid Lighthouse. This might be my favorite lighthouse of all that I visited in Maine. This is amazing. This is so beautiful. Look around you 
you, son. Today is just today and not tomorrow. Where you're going, you can rest your head. Where you're going, brightness looks big. Where you're going, truth cannot be hid. You gotta get going. Easy now. You gotta get going. Easy now. So you can be deserving of the rest that you are given. You gotta slow down and look around you, son. Give a lot and live a little. Work with what you got. Brightness looks big Where you're going Truth cannot be hid You gotta get going Easy now You gotta get going Easy now